were too much early for that and you were just a, you were just a kid guys and you don't need that thing right now hey guys welcome back to my channel hope you all are doing well so today's video is all for the uh, teenage girls who are watching this video right now and i can bet that this video is going to be very very much useful for you guys because i am going to share 10 skincare tips that you will really need in your teenage and i know that most of the girls have mobile phones and 90% of the teenage girls are on social medias also and i know that you also watch videos on youtube on instagram on uh, facebook and there are a lot of uh, lots and lots of bloggers and influencers who make videos on uh, skincare and i know that you guys are really literally confused of all of this hype that is going on in the skincare world right now and uh, you are you must be thinking that uh, what should i do what should i not do what is good for my skin what is bad for my skin and i know that it's really at times it's really too much guys because it's really confusing so i am here today to like uh, tell you the things that are really needed for your skin and the things that are not at all necessary for your skin at this age and I hope that this video is really going to help you a lot so without any further delay let's begin this video so the first tip is understand your skin type so you should wash your face with a gentle cleanser a pH balanced cleanser or a face wash and wait on for just 10 minutes and after that just observe your skin all right so you should uh, observe your skin very carefully after this 10 minutes if your skin is feeling too dry then you have a dry skin and uh, if you if you feel that if your skin is producing some amount of oil then you have oily skin and if you have like oil in this part of your face like in your t-zone and dry in the rest of the part so you will probably have a combination skin so in this way you will understand that what your skin type is so the second tip is you should choose your skincare products according to your skin type so in these days it's very much easy to know about a skincare product because everything is online now and everything about this product the product descriptions are given in the site where you are uh, from where you are buying that product and you will get to know everything about the product from there and you should choose your skincare products very carefully according to your skin type like if you are a dry skin people and you are uh, choosing a very light moisturizer that will not work for you so and if you are an oily skin people and you are choosing a very like creamy moisturizer that will also be not uh, ideal for you so you should choose your product according to your skin type and from your cleanser face wash um, moisturizer sunscreen everything should be aligned according to your skin type so this was the second tip moving on to the third tip is like you should know that skincare is an additional support for you like when you take a medicine you take it because your body is not capable of uh, repairing itself so that's why you take that medicine so that it can help your body to repair itself so at this age uh, during this uh, teenage time your skin is too much like young it's too young and it's too early and your skin is capable of doing all the things that you really need that your skin needs so you don't need that additional product additional support to make your skin look younger because you are already too much young guys and you don't need that much products for your skin so next is stick to the basics so the basics are the most basics of a skincare routine are cleanser moisturizer and a sunscreen so i remember that when i was a teenager i used to just use a moisturizer and i used the same moisturizer Time and, also the night time. and I really didn't have any idea about what skincare is, what is a moisturizer, why should I need that, blah blah blah. So my mother used to bring a moisturizer and I used to apply that every night and day. And uh, it's just enough for a teenager and it's not necessary that you should use a, uh, you should use separate moisturizers for uh, your daytime and for the night time. You don't need any day cream or any night cream just use a single product for your entire day. I have a very 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 dry skin and I can literally uh, feel my skin getting dry and flaky especially during the winter so I use the moisturizer 
more during the winters than in the summers and yeah i also use sunscreen so that my skin uh don't get damaged guys don't forget to apply your sunscreen because it's really important because sunscreen protects your skin from the harmful uv rays and it keeps your skin young for a very long period of time and it also protects from uh, your skin getting damaged and uh, getting tanned and pigmented so please wear a sunscreen it's really important so i will suggest you that during your daytime you should uh, wash your face with a proper cleanser apply a moisturizer and then apply your sunscreen as the last step and during your night time you should uh, again wash your face with a cleanser and uh, apply a moisturizer and this time you don't need a sunscreen because the sun is not there during the night so i remember that uh, मैं तो कभी कभी रात में फेस वॉश भी नहीं करती थी और ऐसे ही सो जाती थी बिकॉज दैट टाइम आई वी डोंट हैव एनी आइडिया दैट वॉट स्किन केयर इज बिकॉज यू कैज यूर रियली लकी दैट यू गेट दैट सोशल मीडिया एंड यू गेट टू नो ऑल द थिंग्स ऑल द स्टाफ दैट आर अबाउट स्किन केयर ऑन द यूट्यूब ऑन इंस्टाग्राम ऑन फेसबुक एंड इट रियली हेल्प यू गाइज टू नो गेन नॉलेज अबाउट स्किन केयर एंड you can store that for your future reference you don't need to uh, apply that all now you can just stick to your basics during your teenage time and uh, everything else you will need after your 20 so keep that in your mind for your future and don't try to apply those things because all the influencers all the bloggers they are not teenagers and they are much um, elder than you all so the products they are applying those things are not necessary for your skin and uh, so don't try to apply them now the fifth tip is guys please don't do diys and please don't use any brightening or whitening agent on your skin because i made that mistake and i don't want you all to make that mistake so i'm warning you please don't apply any diy skincare routine because diy is not going to help you guys and it's all about your psyche that you may think that applying this will make your skin brighter and whiter but that never happens so don't uh, make this mistake so you may ask that why this diy is a harmful why every time i say that diy is not uh, good for our skin so the answer to this question is very much easy like you can also get the answer if you uh, think it twice Because the proportion in which we mix the ingredients in a DIY product, uh, we are not uh, like we cannot give the guarantee that this much proportion is um, suitable for our skin because that's not experimented, right? The products that we use, the skincare products that we use, they are made in the laboratories and they are made after a lot of experiments. That how much is uh, suitable for our skin? But the DIY things that we make at our homes, using the kitchen uh, things that are not. like always good for our skin so that's why please guys please avoid diy skin care uh, and please don't do that please don't uh, harm your skin so moving on to the fifth tip guys i know that many of you girls exfoliate or scrub your skin almost daily or four to five times a week please don't do that please 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 don't do that because your skin has that power of regeneration and the cell turnover process that is present in every human being it's really too much quick in this age in your age so you don't need that uh, exfoliation from outside and you may think that by scrubbing your face you are going to uh, boost the process the time taken by the process but that's not the thing so you should uh, scrub your face once in 10 days or once in a week and that's just enough like that's completely enough for your skin and also please don't try to use chemical exfoliation because chemical exfoliation is something that you can use after you are 20s or in your uh, early 20s you can uh, start chemical exfoliation but don't do this when you are 13 or 15 years of age and you are thinking that chemical exfoliation can help your skin to like glow and uh, become smoother that never happens so the next thing is many of you girls think that you need a anti aging product and you are getting older and that's why you need a anti aging product in your skincare routine 
like seriously guys like how can you even think of that like when i was a teenager i can't even think that i am getting older and i need a anti aging product from for my skin you are too much early for that and you are just a you are just a kid guys and you don't need that thing right now like when somebody is at least 21 years old then somebody can think of using a anti aging product but you don't need that right now because you are just a kid guys you don't need that and keep it that for later on you can use it in your 20s and you don't need that now just don't just not absolutely not so few more things guys that i should tell you is uh, besides all these uh, tips that i gave you just now you should also follow this thing so that your skin gets back a glow from inside so the first one is double cleanse your face whenever you wear a makeup so this is not just for you guys only this is for applicable for all like if you are in their 20s or in their 30s 40s and 50s everybody should double cleanse their face whenever uh, we wear a makeup so that's absolutely necessary so the second thing is wear a sunscreen every day during your daytime Uh, sunscreen is something that will protect your skin, and uh, like because UV rays don't listen to anybody. They can penetrate through your window panels. They can penetrate through your curtains, and you just need to wear a sunscreen to protect your skin. Because if you don't wear a sunscreen, everything else that you do for your skin, everything will go in vain. So we don't want that. So that's why please don't forget to apply a sunscreen. Even if you are inside your rooms, apply a sunscreen. always so the third thing is drink lots and lots of water because water is very good for hydrating uh, your skin and your body and uh, the main thing that our skin needs is hydration because hydration is very much important for anybody for anybody's uh, skin so please always uh, please try to drink to drink at least 3 uh, liters of water every day so the fourth and the final thing So I know that uh, most of you guys don't do this on a everyday basis, and I will suggest you if you, if it's not possible every day, please try to do this at least four days a week because it's really important for everybody. And please try to exercise a bit and uh, for at least half an hour because when we exercise, we get a lot of sweat, and that really helps our skin. push all the toxins from inside so that it comes out through the sweat and it really uh, keeps it really keeps your skin like toxin free so please uh, try to exercise at least for half an hour and for at least 4 days a week and that will be enough if not possible every day and if it is possible you can also do that every day so that will be great and it will also uh, keep you healthy so yeah guys for all the smart girls out there i know that girls are extremely smart and extremely intelligent so just don't waste your money in all the products that are just not needed for your skin because you are all very smart i know so try to invest your money and don't waste your money in like buying some products that are not at all necessary for your skin so uh be a little smart and uh, that was all so yeah guys that was all about this video so i hope that this video was really helpful for you all and i try to share lots of information as much as possible by me and if you like this video please don't forget to give a big fat thumbs up on this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also hit the bell icon so that you get notified every time i post See you again in my next video till then stay fit stay healthy stay happy i love you all